funky. Hey guys, what's going on? My name's Tom, and the other day I saw this video titled I lived off two dollars a day, and this is what happened. This video is made by Luke Corns. I'll like link the video in the description. But yeah, so basically in this video, I learned that half the world's population lives off less than two dollars fifty American a day. He tried to live off that for a week. I'm gonna give that a try today, but. I'm giving myself three dollars fifty because of the like the currency exchange rate and all that all that crap. Anyway, three meals and I can't spend more than three dollars fifty today. I'm gonna go across to the shops and I'm gonna get myself some breakfast. I don't know if I'm even gonna be able to get a meal, like a whole meal, for under three dollars fifty, let alone three. So let's go. So I realised that me not actually being able to spend money today means that I can't drive my car. So that's why I'm walking to the shop. So I am back from the shops and that was kind of, that was eventful. Like, I was there for about sort of 15, 20 minutes and I kind of, I quickly realised that there was nothing, yeah, there was nothing for like under a dollar, you know, like the, the cheapest thing I could get. I actually ended up being the banana, I like, I had to reweigh it and like one of the ladies from the shop had to like cancel my thing because it was too heavy, so I had to go back and change it. Um, but yeah, so this is my, so my receipt came out at $3.45, which left me Five cents change, so that's that's going in the piggy bank. I got a can of tuna, which was 90 cents, which is like, and this bread roll only cost me 60 cents because they're like the bakery ones and they're always the same price anyway, I think. Um, I got a banana, because like, you know. And these, I also got these YY Tom Yum shrimp flavor noodles. I don't know, <laughs> we'll see how it goes. This is the savior, a dollar for two serves of a cup of noodles. The time is 12.24 and I still haven't eaten yet. So I'm about to eat something, I guess. Like when I was in the shops, I thought it was really crazy. Cause like, I couldn't even afford dog food. Like, dog food. I couldn't even afford dog food, which was just fucking insane. But yeah, like the amount of things that I just, I didn't have enough money for. Was, yeah, it was madness. I'm gonna make a home style chicken noodle cup of soup. So the instructions say to like <clears throat> pour this, like yeah, the sachet in first and then put the water in and then stir it for a bit. But like it just looks like there's like nothing in there. So I kind of get why it's only a dollar. But so I'm going to put the second serve in as well. I can actually like feel the MSG going into my body right now. In before I forget that the water's boiling and I just drink it right now. It's not actually bad, but if I had to do this every day, I'd, I'd get over it, but these noodles are nice. Well, that was meal one, I guess. I'm just gonna like drink this and then, <laughs> yeah. I'll see you guys when I'm hungry again. 12 seconds later. So it's been like probably an hour and a half and I'm starving now. Like I'm that hungry. So I could either have like a bread roll with tuna and a banana and then like only have noodles for dinner or do it the other way around. I can have noodles and maybe a banana. One second. So the noodles like I literally just had to like wait. Oh my god. It said like cover them for three minutes. I'm hoping that this is like the equivalent of ramen. I don't know because like we don't have, in Australia we don't have ramen. That's not bad. I've been so hungry. Like it's 20 to 3. And all I've eaten is those two cup of soups. 
It's crazy. I don't understand how people can survive like this. So I'm just gonna eat these and probably feel sad. They're not bad, actually. I've never had bloody Tom Yum shrimp soup or something. The noodles taste like fake though. Like chewing them, they're, they're like sound rubbery in my head. Which is weird. I'm so white. Why are these fucking why are these spicy? It was literally like two seconds before I made these. I was like, oh my god, look how much salt is in these. And now I'm complaining it's spicy. I literally am eating these noodles so quick because I'm like that hungry. That was the end of my second meal. I think it's just silly like how little I've eaten today and I'm already like I've only got one thing left. I'll see you guys back here for dinner. Um <laughs> which will probably be in like 10 minutes because I'm that hungry and it will only be like 3 o'clock. Welcome back. Or like, I don't, I don't know. Welcome back to me. Anyway, this time I'm really hungry. Like it's 10 past 4 and <coughs> I'm so hungry. So I'm just going to eat. This challenge is like really like opened my eyes to how some people live. Like for me, this was a choice, and it's like it's like light-hearted as the whole idea of it is. Tomorrow, I'm gonna go back to eating like normal. I'm gonna go back to spending money on food and I, all that because because I live like a privileged life. Right, you know what I mean? I have everything really that I can need. So it's kind of really like, yeah, it's eye-opening to see that some people would be living like this. It's fucking horrible. Oh. I'll drain out the oil. This is pretty much it. Like that's, this is for the rest of my day until I go to bed tonight. What the fuck? Anyway, I'll see you guys. Dessert? I don't know. I'm gonna have to eat this now. Like, I guess I'm just gonna have to be hungry for the rest of the rest of the day. This tastes really good. Like the best thing I've eaten all day. I guess that's it. Like, I finished the banana. Um, this whole day was like really eye-opening. Just seeing how how like 50% of the world's population like live, how like what they have to survive on. Thanks for watching. If you liked, you know, want to see more, stick around, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video. See ya.